Hi guys, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. So we have successfully set up the Firebase database and all those things, right? Now it's time for us to get the nodes from the database instead of hard coding this one. Let's see here our Firebase. So how the Firebase database looks like. If you go into this one, if you go to the console, if you go to our console and here you'll be able to see the nodes list type view. This is our project, right? So let's create a nodes list type view. Uh, sorry, not creating. Let's open. And in this one, let's go to the Firestore database, which we have created it. And we have already created two documents in this one, first content and also the second content. If you try to see here, this is a collection and these are the two documents. Now, instead of getting the data, hard coding the data, these all data, we need to get it from the store. Okay, from this, not the store, from the database. For this reason, what we will try to do is, first what I want to do, if I open our code, at the first time when I am loading, I need to get the nodes data. Nodes data means I want to get the get all the nodes from the database. For this one, what we can do is, we can go to the app.view, which is an uh, entry point, and in this one, we can call the get nodes. So we will be, you need to get the get nodes data. For this one, what we need to do, in the node store, so we need to create an action. So that is nothing but constant get nodes. So this is our store and here let's try to do console.log get nodes from firebase. So this is a console and we need to call it at the starting. So that means in the app.view. Let's constant nodes store is equal to use nodes store. And I'm importing the node store and here on mounted. So when this app.view is mounted, we need to import this on mounted from the view. And here I will be calling nodes store. Nodes store. Let's get this node store. Nodes store. Okay. Dot get nodes. So I will be calling this get nodes here. Yeah. That's it, guys. So now when the app.view is loaded, at the first time I will be calling the node store. If you if you try to see the output now if you go here and if you try to see the output let's see let's refresh this page and we will see it again and got get notes is not a function get notes is not a function yeah why it is not a function is we have created the get notes and we need to return it at the bottom right get notes that's it now if you see the output let's go and if you see the output at the first time we need to get the call. So it is calling get nodes from the Firebase. Now in this method, so now our action is what we need to do is in this method node store, we need to query into the database, query into the collection and we need to get all the data. That means nothing but the, all the nodes from the Firestore database. For this one, what we need to do is let's go to the Firestore and here let's open the documentation. If you open the documentation and we will go to the Firestore. And in this Firestore, let's go, let's move on to the Firestore. And here you'll be able to see the read data, right? So let's go into this one and click on this get data. And you'll be able to see so many different ways how we can get the data. Let it open. Yeah, get data with the cloud Firestore. So there are so many things. Initialize the cloud store. We have already did it. And this one is the set doc and all those in different types. So to get started, write some data about cities. So he is writing some data. Get a document. If you want to get a single document like this and here custom objects if you want to get a particular objects you want to get it multiple documents that means where condition and all the things yeah here this is the thing which we need it get all the documents in a collection yes we need to get all the documents in the collection that collection is nothing but the, our notes collection i want to get all the documents that are present in the notes collection for this one what we need to do we need to call the get docs collection of db here cities means in our place that near the collection name that is nodes and after getting the query snapshot we need to loop over each doc document and we need to console it. let's copy this one all okay i will be copying this one all and let's paste it here where in the get nodes where is this get nodes yeah here in this get nodes i will be pasting this one all that's it so now this one is an await right for this reason we need to use the async so when you're using await async and this get docs, this is the method available in the Firestore. So this should be available. Yeah. Okay. Let's collection. And this is our collection. Why right? this one is not coming. 
I don't know something happened. Yeah, input from file base file store. I think let's go get docs. Yeah, and also the collection. So these are the two things. So get docs and also a collection. And this DB need to be imported. This DB where we need to import it from the I don't know why this DB is also not coming. Import db from we will be having in our js file right in js and here in this one we'll be having the firebase and this should import the db yeah we got the db and here we need to call the nodes instead of the cities why because the collection name for us available is the nodes so this is the collection name this is the collection name now fine we got the data and we are consoling the doc.id and also the doc.data we are looping over each document Let's see whether we are able to get the output or not. If you try to see the output, let's go to the console. Uh, refresh this page. I don't know. Oh, what is this happening? Let's see uh, from where we need to import it. My imports are not working. Firebase slash file store. Okay. Let's go to here. And where is this Firebase slash file store? Yeah. We'll see whether we can able to get the output or not this time this time we should be able to get the output yeah we got the output and here you'll be able to see the content right so whatever the console we have to infer their doc document that id is an id one and also we are able to see in the data the content now we got the content and also we got the data now what i need to do i need to push this all the data into the nodes so right now this should hard this is hard coded i will remove this all the code right now this nodes here everything is empty right now what I will try to do is I here I will create a node single node and in this one you will be having an id which is nothing but doc.id and the another one is the content which is doc.data.content I can have this content now we got the node and here what I can do is we need to push that single node into the nodes so here what I can do nodes.push of node okay and this one is a ref right so we need to do the notes dot value that push that's it finish in the app dot you we are doing the we are calling the get notes now i hope that everything will be working fine now if i try to refresh the page we are able to get the data yes we are able to get the data now what i will do is i will change the second note and here i will write it as edited okay edited i will update this one to edited and if i try to refresh this page so here we will be able to see second note as edited right now we are able to see that we are able to get the data from the database okay we are not hard coding we are not getting the data hard coded we are getting it from the database so that is the thing i want to show you now if i if i add a new document here if i click on the add document and here i will create a new document and here this is the content and here i will get third content or something like this so whatever the thing yeah here it should be sorry third content spelling mistake yeah now if i save it here so we got an another one with the third content and if i go and if i refresh this page now we should be able to see the third content also see now successfully we are able to get all the data from the firebase database so this is the thing which i want to tell you so here if you see the output and in the node store so this is the code which we have written first we are getting documentation all the doc documents from the collection nodes and we are connecting to the db and after getting all the query snapshot we are looping over each document and we are preparing the object note object and we are pushing into the nodes value this is how we will be doing the uh, we, we will be reading the data or documents all the documents from a collection in this, in this one and what I will do is as usual, I will commit these all the code in a new branch video hyphen 95 whoever may be having a doubts regarding this one. So they can refer to this one uh, and here uh, get all documents from database. I will be writing here. I will commit this all the code. Now whoever may be having a doubts and all those things. We already have a GitHub repository URL github.com slash notes list hyphen view here you'll be able to see yeah video hyphen 95 
now you are, who are maybe having a doubts and all those things of that particular video they can go to that particular video branch and they can refer to that code hope you understood about this uh, getting of the data if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you